Hello and welcome to In the Garage. This is things to know about the Fastway Flash Series ball mounts. Alright, so with the Flash Series you have three different options to choose from. You have the E-Series, you have the Solid Toe Series, and you have the Adjustable Locking Series. Let's get these unboxed and show you what makes each of them stand out. All right, so up first we have the E-Series ball mount. Let's take a look at this a little bit closer. So the one thing about the E-Series that you need to know before we get this on the truck is how fast and easy it is to adjust the ball along the mount. And these are uh, notched at one inch increments, as you can see there. So if you want to move the ball up the mount, it really is as easy as sliding it up and putting the pin in place. Now, like I mentioned earlier, we can have this in any orientation we want it to go in. So if we want to have a, a uh, lift, We'll place it in the receiver tube that way so we can have a higher trailer or be accessible to more high trailers that way. We can also put this in a drop orientation. So depending on the trailer you're, uh, trailer you're hauling, uh, you can put this in any orientation really and get a very large distance of trailer heights that easy. Okay, so you can secure this in a traditional sense using just the st uh, standard pin that you see there for hauling trailers. Fastway recommends using their E-Series, the dual lock pack. Now what that is, these are lockable pins. So if you have any concerns with somebody maybe wanting to steal your uh, ball mount, this is gonna prevent that from happening. Okay, so now what we're gonna do is go ahead and put one of these in place and secure the drop mount. All right, so now nobody can pull this out but you, the one with the key. That easy, very secure. Okay, so let's take a look at the double ball now. Now you can mount this in any type of orientations you'd like. So because it's a double ball, you can flip depending on the trailer size that you have. If you, want a, if you need a bigger ball, you have that uh, option. If you need a smaller ball, you have that option as well. And you can mount this along any point along the side. I don't know if you can see those, but they're in one inch increments. And you can mount this along any of those uh, aligned slots. You can also stow this away. So these happen to be shin magnets, and I know that firsthand experience, and they hurt. They don't feel good on the leg. So fast way thought of that. And you actually stow this in the reverse position. You put your pin right through the slot like you normally would, but with the ball backwards. And that way there's not gonna be anything jutting out there that's gonna hit your shin uh, when you're coming around the back of your truck. All right, so let's go ahead and put this into position. I say about the third Slot up looks pretty good to me. Put that in place, lock it, and you have a very secure ball mount now that's ready to do some work. All right, so let's take a look at the solid toe ball mount. Now, what makes this one stand out is the fact that this is a non rattle solution to all your towing needs. Now, how does that work? So, what we got to see, or what you're going to see here, is the fact that the kit comes with an Allen key or an Allen wrench. You ever drop uh, drop mount as normal and then your double ball. Now what you'll see though is you have this screw that you can tighten and loosen and look at the back side you'll see that that is tightening in and that's going to tighten into the drop mount. So let's give this a test and show you how, how it works. So let's take the drop mount and again this is very adjustable like all fast way hitches or ball mounts super super easy to adjust and it's very quick to do as well. So how you do this I'll show you from the side so you can see it a little bit better. There's these little notches that have been cut into the drop mount. And all you do is line up your double ball in between, just like that. And then I'm gonna take the opposite side here, and I'm gonna tighten that in. Now that kind of locks the uh, double ball into place, but that's not all. So let me just shake this a little bit. So it's very, really, really solid and it's not going to go anywhere. But they've also included a safety lock screw here as well. So take your uh, Allen wrench in again, tighten that down, and that's going to tighten your original screw. So it's not going to go anywhere, guys. It's not going to go anywhere. It's not going to go loose over the course of your journey to wherever you're going with your trailer. So that is a double secure anti-rattle solution for your towing needs right there, guys. No rattle at all. Now let's move up to the top, so the receiver tube. Now, this is just like I showed you before. We have another one of the screws you're gonna put your Allen wrench into, and it's here. Now, what this is gonna do, so we've eliminated the rattle between the ball 
and the drop mount now, so that's great. But now you're gonna maybe even worry about the, the rattle between your receiver tube and the rest of the mount. So what we can do here is I'm just gonna show you this just to demonstrate. Begin to tighten that. As you can see, this uh, conical pin begins to raise. Okay, so in essence, what this does, that eliminates the gap between your receiver tube and the mount here. So that reduces the, the rattle in the receiver tube as well, guys. So there's triple protection there for any rattle that you can expect from your, from your hitch or from your ball mount. So this is a great solution if you want that quiet ride and no worries down the road. Now again, just like the E series, we can mount this in either orientation. So a drop or a lift, depending on what we need. We're just gonna go ahead and do a drop. Now again, we can use a standard pin. So if we wanna use a standard pin, go ahead and do that. However, again, Fastway recommends using their locking pins just for security purposes. So we'll go ahead and take another one of their security pins. Again, it's easy as a, a key and a lock. Feed it through and lock it off just like that. So now this is nice and secure. Okay, now to orientate this one, what you're gonna wanna do is it comes with an Allen wrench. So make sure you have that on hand and you're gonna align the double ball and there's these little notches that have been grooved into the hang mount. Now, what we're gonna do is align this in the center of those and tighten this up. Now, there's this one Allen slot. We've already tightened that down. Let's take a look at the other side. Now, this is what makes this one really cool. So there's another slot here for the Allen wrench. <clears throat> we're gonna plug it in and tighten that down as well. And that prevents any, of, any, any person but yourself with the tool from tampering with this, with this screw. So they can't do that because the security screw is tightened down as well. So that's nice and secure and rattle free. Now, it's not all rattle free because we still have the receiver tube. So what we're gonna do is take our tool again, another Allen slot, and this is gonna raise the conical pin that's on top of the receiver tube on the hang mount. We're gonna tighten that up into position. It's gonna take a few rounds. But again, if you, I don't know if you can see that, but it, we're tightening this conical pin. It's raising up against the receiver tube. And what that does is it removes all the gap that the vibration call, is caused by. So now we have no rattle other than anything further in. So we're nice and secure and rattle free. So there's not gonna be any of that noise going down the road. And that's what really makes this solid tow kit unique. All right, let's take a look at the adjustable locking ball mount now. So what makes this one stand out is the fact that it can lock in position. And let me show you what I mean by that. Let's let, the, let's let the product speak for itself. So I do want you to notice, first of all, we have a, a pin here that's in the end position. Now, on the side, you're gonna see this little seal that you can lift out and has a space for a key. I'm gonna add my key. I'm gonna give it a half turn. Now take a look at this pin. The pin is gonna retract fully and it's gonna make room for my drop mount. So if we find the, the position we want, um, what we're gonna do is I'll find the position. I like that pretty good. That's gonna be the size of my trailer that makes the most sense to me. So I'm gonna let the key out, reseal it. Now that's locked into place. Just that simple with the turn of a key. Now, you may notice one here as well, so let's just go ahead and show you what that is all about. Now this is gonna go to the receiver, uh, receiver tube, of course. Now, this is a pinless, doesn't require any pins, it's a pinless ball mount. What I mean by that is, I'm gonna go ahead and re release this seal as well, add my key, again, same key, give it a half turn, that retracts those completely. So now I can add this into my receiver tube, I'll line up the pin slots, and then let it back out. And it's gonna fill those slots perfectly so nobody can take a bar or anything like a pipe and break that off. So it's a very secure option and it's very easy to do with one single key, guys. Now all you do, put your key into the key slot, give it a half turn, and you'll see that it retracted all the way. And that gives us space to put this into our receiver tube. All right, so get it lined up. Give the key a counterclockwise turn. And that is locked in place and it's not going anywhere. The double ball also has the same technology built in as you'll see. 
the retractable pin there in the center, and this allows us to ride up the rail. And with this application, you can also put this on the front and on the back as well, so if you wanted to stow it away, keep it out of your uh, shin's reach, that's also something you can do. But let's go ahead and put this in place on the front of the rail system here. So I'll take my key again, put it into place, and I'll show you again. I'll give this a half turn, and you can see that the pin retracts. That's going to allow us to put this in our desired position along the rail. Okay? So when we have it in place, we'll give it a counterclockwise turn, pull the key, reseal the seal, and guys, we are secure and ready to tow. All right, guys, so you've seen the E-Series, you've seen the Solid Tow, and you've seen the Adjustable Locking Series from the Flash Series of Fastway. Guys, we talked about what makes them all different, but also what makes them unique and great within the, their own respects. And they're all really great ball mounts, but they all have really unique things that make them different. And guys, there are some things that make them very much the same. And what those are, they're made of a 6061 T6. It's an aircraft grade aluminum. So it's a very, very lightweight, but also very, very strong in the same right. Now, with that said, they're also all made in the United States and hand polished. So what you get out of the box is a great high quality piece that's gonna last you for many years to come. Now, a few more details about this product or the other products we've discussed earlier. Check the description below. We'll have it all laid up there for you there, as well as part numbers and a dealer locator so you can find these kits at a dealer near you. Thanks again for tuning in. This has been Total Truck Centers in the Garage.